press the bell icon on YouTube and don't miss another update. If you look at the Tiger Lake 11 Gen core processor along with Intel XE graphics, first of all, when you look at performance that we are delivering on the basis of a new architecture, new graphics engine, new AI capabilities, uh, and on top of that, also building on the Evo Valley proposition of Project Athena innovation program, it is truly transformational what we are trying to accomplish. And how it converts to what consumers are demanding out of their PC platforms is, if you look at large parts of uh, consumers and businesses, they want performance, they want disconnected performance, as in mobility, they demand performance across a variety of workloads at the same time, not only gaming, not only entertainment, not only uh, collaboration or communication, but all of it. And they are also looking for devices that become extension of themselves, especially for millennials, especially for new age users. So when you look at Lemon Generation Core, as well as Intel Evo platform, it fits all of it. It is the best processor for thin and light notebooks, bar none. It is the best graphics engine we have delivered. And generation to generation, Ice Lake to Tiger Lake, or against competition, head and shoulders about performance across a variety of vectors. I would say very, very significant. So when you look at India as well as globally, you would see that in our financial results and you would see that uh, in some of the uh, software company results as well. The work from home and learn from home and the capability or the technology being so much more important now than ever before. So that's a very consistent trend. Uh, second is PCs have become more important now that Consumers and businesses earlier thought I could do this on the smartphone, but they realized that they could not do many of the usages as well on a smartphone as they can on the PC. For example, they cannot learn as effectively on a smartphone. They cannot create as effectively on a smartphone. They cannot collaborate as well on a smartphone versus a PC. And you see that uh, results reflected in some of the demand we are seeing in the country. Uh, for example, IDC data, you're seeing the uh, notebook surge, really. It went up 17.6% uh, in uh, Q2 of this year. In businesses, large businesses, uh, due to business uh, continuity processes or other needs, I would say the proof of the pudding is in eating, right? Uh, and for a technology company, for an innovation company like ours, our ambition and desire always is to push the boundaries on what's possible. And the purpose, to realize that purpose of enriching lives of every person on earth uh, by creating world-changing technology. So when you look at the innovation, and I will give you an example only on the PC innovation because the context is that, the innovation around Lemon Gen, innovation on uh, XE graphics, innovation on uh, Evo is a great example of a journey that we have been on for decades now. And when you look at where PC started, which a category that we invented as a company, and how we progressed to mobility, and I've been with the company 20 years, uh, and I can, uh, I still remember when we launched Centrino because whenever you think mobility, you think smartphones. But that's not true because mobility is as much about PCs. And when we integrated Wi Fi with a laptop, that just exploded the market. And in 12 to 18 months' time, you had integrated Wi Fi in almost every notebook platform that was bought everywhere in the world. So think about what that meant in terms of moving the ecosystem forward 
as a PC industry. That's one of our biggest trends to progress the ecosystem. We didn't stop there. So we reinvented on how mobility um, or the PC mobility, PC computing happened. Then we reinvented the same with Ultrabooks. And Centrino happened uh, 2003, 2011. We looked at PCs and the needs of consumers. Then we had Ultrabook as a strategy or as an industry-wide initiative to really reimagine what notebooks should look like. That meant we created new platform on our side. We engaged with our OEM customers, our ODMs, um, the uh, component uh, um, manufacturers in the supply chain, all to create new platforms that were transformational versus the previous generation. And Ultrabook is again, one step forward in the journey of evolution or redefining PC computing or mobility. The, the, what you are seeing today with Project Athena Innovation Program, and the, we are in the second gen, second year of that journey with Intel Evo platform, is very similar. We came to a conclusion that our consumer and business needs are very different, which I talked about right at the beginning. They, they want their devices to function for a variety of real life usages and not one one kind of uh, uh, collaboration or uh, connectivity, but all they want to get entertained. They want to play games on it, everything combined. So how do we in mobility space create that experience, which is truly transformative? And that's Project Athena. So we uh, initiated that last year and then we raised the bar on that benchmark performance or what we believe is the best in class performance. And we have tools where we test uh, each project in our platform uh, before certifying it. That means that any consumer buying a project uh, Athena platform, Intel Evo platform, as an example, stands um, to experience the best laptop you can experience which means less than a second of uh, sleeping to fully functional, uh, eight hours or more of battery life, which is really close to all day battery life and eight hours or more I'm talking about. You have four hours of charge in less than 30 minutes. You've got Thunderbolt 4, which is game changing in terms of interface, Wi-Fi 6, game changing in terms of connectivity. If you combine all of this, and I'm, we're not stopping there, we are innovating on hinges. We are innovating on materials. We are innovating on motherboards to shrink that motherboard to increase the battery life so that the span of battery goes up. We are shrinking the motherboard also to create antennas, which increases the Wi-Fi capability. You get what I'm saying? The, the, the innovation in the ecosystem to transform notebooks from where they were to what they are going to be in the next three, five, ten years is Project Athena. So the the journey of innovation and the journey of raising the bar is not single point, single instance. And that would be my response to your question saying, how are we leading? And you look at the results of what Lemon Gen uh, with the Intel XE graphics or uh, Intel Evo performs in variety of workloads versus competition or versus our previous generation, yeah, it, it is the best laptop in thin and light, uh, uh, best processor in thin and light laptops, bar none. Look, Apple is a very strong customer of ours across various business segments, and we would continue to serve them. We continue to be committed, strongly committed to them.